Hi guys, good afternoon. Today I'm gonna speak about the joy and pleasure I'm having due to this Hoya Linearis. So this is my Hoya Linearis. So the buds of these flowers, they came at the start of September and I'm having this bloom from the start of October. So there's such a lovely flower, like I literally love them so i'm gonna show you my hoya it's here so i'm gonna talk about how i care this plant and a few things about the propagation so let's start with this bloom let me show you the bloom so it's so beautiful if we show you yeah so um but the the thing which I like most about this Hoya is the fragrance. These flowers, they look small, but they like give off some very, very, very like lovely fragrance during the evening. And I'm on, in, in the evening when I'm on bed and I'm doing my work, so I smell the fragrance in the whole room. So it's so, so beautiful. So um, this Hoya Linearis, I got it when I was baby and it's still in the nursery pot because they're really pot bone. They don't wanna, um, they don't like a uh, change of pot like much. So that's why I just kept it in the same pot and grew a lot, you can see. So what I do, I'm keeping it in this pot where it gets a uh, bright uh, light um, most of the day. And in the evening, it gets like uh, the direct sunlight as well. But during summers, I keep it uh, either I keep the blind zone or I move it on that side of the window, like this. So I move it here. So during the winters, because sun is not that much strong, even if it's getting, getting direct sunlight, it's not so bad for it. And um, I, d uh, I water it when it's completely dry. Uh, this Hoya, if I talk about it compared to my other Hoyas, it like it gets thirsty quickly. One reason could be because the pot is very small and it's a big, big plant. So it gets dries out quickly. So you have to watch out like, what size of plant you're having and also um, where the plant is. It depends. So water it only when it's dry. So what my criteria is, I don't put moisture in vitro because it's very delicate roots. So I just pick the plant like this and if it's like very light, um, I can feel like, oh, this is thirsty at the moment. And also the leaves of the plant, they tell you when the plant is thirsty. Sometimes they like droop and they're not like that much um, uh, taken succulent. So I can see that. I can sense that. Um, and soil, I haven't changed the soil yet. But I fertilize the plant um, using a very dilute liquid fertilizer. Um, like 10 person in the solution so I just whenever I water it I give it to this lovely lovely plant so what I'm gonna uh, I'm, I'm thinking I'm gonna find out another way out because I love this plant I'm gonna place it here on this side as well so because of the flowers I am in, fallen in love with this plant and best I so far I don't have any problem with the best I couldn't find any best in this plant uh, thanks God, luckily. And then one of the shoot it started like dying out from this side. You can see this side is a bit bald. So what I did, I just, uh, when it was just like a bit like drying out, I just cut it. And what I did, I put that in the water. And I kept it in water for like six weeks. Uh, then when the roots were quite big. So it was quite a long shoot. So I cut it off. So what, how I cut it, you can see the roots like over here. So just cut it from this point and cut the woody point as well. And just the root node, I just stick it in the in the soil, well-drained soil. Um, so I just put them here so you can see. Um, and these were the ones with the roots. So I just left this a bit long and there's another one uh, like this. So I just, I'm just keeping it near to the mummy plant. Maybe they've got some coordination and the babies will come out. Let's see. So I'll show you the progress later. So it's, uh, I did it. They propagated it like soil propagation. I did on, I think, 30th of October. So I'll show you the progress and hopefully it will do well. Um, it will it will not like give up. It will do well. Yeah. 
so that's all from my Hoya, Lady Aris and the lovely lovely flowers. So hope you will enjoy this video and don't forget to thumbs up and like and share my videos. So see you again. Bye bye. Take care.